Hey everybody, this is Nick Cuenca from the Hyperloops.com, and I'm here to do a little review on some tokens that I got. Um, the uh, good people at Surly Good Designs uh, were nice enough to send us these. We had our, we had posted a list a link uh, to their website uh, because we like their tokens so much and they're local guys, and uh, they just sent us some. <clears throat> and I'm really uh, I I like them quite a bit. Uh, so these are these are the keys, and uh, as you can tell, they're made of a very high quality little plastic. Uh, I like how they're they're uh, they're not too big, they're not too small, but they're just a good size. Uh, I'll use them. Um, I'll use a D20 for for scale. So that's how they are, and I, I like them. They're they're, uh, they're they're sturdy. I can't really bend them. Um, they sort of have the consistency of like a nice of a nice poker chip, but they're thicker. Uh, so yeah, certainly good designs. Uh, I like the keys quite a bit. Um, this right here, this little circle, is for the for the chain tracker. So you'd put your little tracker here, and as you see, it's quite clear what number it is. Again, a very solid. Uh, solid material, plastic, if you will. Uh, some people like to say acrylics, maybe. I don't know. It depends on what kind of person you are, really. Uh, so these are ones that they are... I don't know if they're, they're selling them, but... Uh, they told me that these weren't out yet uh, when they gave this to us. But these are like shield, token, shield tokens. So you put these on the guys with shield. And uh, frankly, I don't really see the point of these. Uh, but I don't see the point of the plus one power things that they give you. I feel like that's, a lot of times, that's just sort of self-evident that that's happening. Uh, and uh, the ones that they have only come in ones, and sometimes there are twos, and I don't really, I like to keep my play areas as neat as possible, and having many of these. Uh, they are nice, though, so if you do, I like, I do like the color. Uh, they are etched pretty nicely. That's the back when it doesn't have the, the little, uh, little back here. Uh, it depends on what kind of person you are. Sometimes I like to keep them on there just because it protects the back. But then you're like, well, what's the point of having a nice back if you can't see it? So it's kind of kind of like see-through. It's it. I mean, I think it's good. It's a good color. But I just personally don't like playing with that stuff. I saw someone with one, with one and they put it on the card and I was like, really? It says it right there. Like it says two. It says one. Let's play the game. Come on. And uh, so here, here are the. F they have uh, damages, which is the five, the three, and the one. Uh, these are uh, these are pretty nice. Um, there is a sometimes there's a little dot here, so maybe that could be cleaned up a little bit. But you, know, you just scratch at it, gets it there. Uh, that's what they look like when it has the paper back. Uh, this is the more uh, transparent. See if we get the, the zoom in there. Yeah, there you go. Uh, and that's what it looks like on the back there. Cool. Uh, I like these quite a bit. Uh, I think that if you were in the market for that sort of uh, damage counter, you could do certainly much worse. And here are what are my favorite by far. And these are the amber tokens. And I actually really like these in clear. Uh, I'm not really like a specialty token kind of person, but uh, these are nice. These are very similar sort of feeling to the ones that you get uh, with the game, which uh, I'll compare for for scale. And uh, they're roughly about the same size. Yeah, roughly about the same size, which I like. I like I like having if I'm going to have like specialty tokens, I want them to be very similar. Uh, because it just feels like you're playing with proxies otherwise. Uh, John Finkel had a was quoted in saying that he would not play with proxies uh, because magic was already hard enough as it is. Uh, and I think I think it can be the same could be said for for Keyforge. Uh, Keyforge I find is a very difficult game, and I don't want uh, to be taxed. I don't want to have to like keep track of things uh, more than I have to. And I like my things to be similar uh, throughout. So. 
Uh, that's why I always enjoyed playing uh, whatever the standard token that came with everything, you know, like this is the, the Destiny 3. I, I still use them uh, because, I don't know, just, just your recall, it's like the same every time. Um, I do find it a little annoying when people play with specialty tokens, but I think these are pretty close uh, to what you're saying. They're very clear. Uh, the keys don't really matter. I mean, I feel like it's quite, quite clear that this is forged and this is unforged. And uh, there's, this is what the, what the amber token looks like. Uh, and that's the paperback. So these are, this is more of a, a matte sort of um, style, I guess you'd say. Because uh, these are like transparent. So it really depends, you know, you can keep them on depending on what you like. Uh, this is sort of, you know, it gives you a nice contrast. Sometimes it can be lost, like, you know, this gets lost a little bit more, so... I could definitely see a, an argument to be made for... for keeping them on. Um, they come with these lovely little bags here. Um, nothing really to say about these bags, they're pretty standard bags, you could reuse them. Um, or you could just keep them in there. Uh, whatever you really like. Uh, it doesn't really matter, honestly. Like, you know, use a trash bag. Uh, but, you know, some people like to keep things nice. Uh, I like to keep things nice, too. So, uh, there you have it. There's my review of Surly Good Designs. Uh, I would say that these are definitely worth it if you're in the market for that sort of thing. Um, it won't make you play better, but you'll definitely look cool. Uh, people have definitely asked me. Um... And uh, they were like, wow, those two tokens are really cool, and uh, where did you get them? And I was like, well, a friend gave them to me. And so, yeah. Um, I, hope, uh, I hope you enjoyed this review. This is my first review. I don't really know what to say. But I feel like I, I wanted to get into it, you know? I wanted to, you know, because I do like these. I do honestly like these. I like the keys, and I like these. These are like whatever. I don't really like these. I like the, I do like this tracker though. I feel like the, you know, I, I will say this tracker is way better than the one that they gave you. The other one is so flimsy. This one has some weight to it. See, there's a good review right there. Has some weight, it stays on. The other one you like, you know, you kind of shake the table or whatever. Look, look at that, I'm moving it. It's moving a little bit, but you know, all right, it's moving, but whatever. This is this very slick surface. I'm, no one's gonna be moving this, all right? When you're playing a game. So that's right, uh, representing for the Mars house, the best house. And yeah, that's it. Uh, if you have any questions or comments, please let me know. Um, these are definitely the only tokens I've used for this game so far. Uh, I do like that these are, I like the threes and the fives. I feel like they didn't give us enough damage tokens with the starters and, you know. Uh, since I've just started playing this game, I feel like I can, I can, use different tokens because I don't have that sort of memory anchor to uh, starting the game as much. And yeah, so I would definitely rank these. If I were to give a power ranking to these tokens, um, that's tough. I actually, hmm, these would be down here. I would put this second to last, and I would put these shield tokens down here. Uh, and then I would put, oh, this is tough. These are all these are all the god tier, I'd say. Uh, so I put maybe this. I like this one a lot. This is actually kind of this is neat, you know. Look at the it's little details. So yeah, I would put. I like these keys a lot. I would probably put the keys and then here. But these are all like very close together and how much I like them. Um, these are fine. They're pretty generic. And these are like they look cool, but uh, from a usability perspective, I don't really care for them. So that's my honest review of these tokens. If you like this review, uh, then let me know. If you hated it, uh, also let me know, and I'll never do them again. So there you go. Uh, please like and subscribe for more content. Um, we don't, I don't usually shell things, but you know, a friend, and I like them, so whatever. Uh, and um, yeah, we have a Patreon, which, uh, you know, if you check out our, our real content, uh, we can we'll definitely uh, we'll be more useful. But you know, a like, 
a little thumbs up, you know, give the little man some love. And as always, uh, may the, I don't know, may the, the shadow people not steal your amber, because that's real annoying.